Hi beauties and curls and welcome back for another video and this one's a little bit different. Um, my room is under a renovation right now so I am doing my project pan videos here in my humble restroom. I love it calling it a restroom or my this is like my meat place my spa area so in today's video I'm going to show you guys my finished five by fall. I decluttered some I actually brought some more in so without further ado let's get into the video. So the intro of the finished five by fall I had a couple of items in there. I had my Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation, which I actually have right here. I do have it marked, and it was in the intro here, and now I'm here. Now, I didn't do like a monthly, I'm um, way past a monthly update because I did not do one in August at all, but this is the, there'll be one more update and that'll be the finale so this is update one and then I'll be going straight to the finale because it will be fall in about 20 21 days and I plan to be completely done with this I love this foundation it's definitely something that I will repurchase it's been in quite a few of my favorites videos I love the finish I actually I'm wearing it today I love the fact that it gives me a nice like flawless glow so I really do enjoy this like I said in my favorites video if you want to check it out I'll link it over here of my August favorites but this is one of my favorite foundations and I explained it a little bit more there but I'm not gonna hold up the time but I really do love this foundation and again oh really quick tip if you want to know where you are and you can't find out this is one of the things that I have been doing so I will take the nozzle I mean the what is this the pump right this is actually how I measured it because the bo the bottle is frosted and dark I completely wipe off the pump the stick of the pump right so then I take it and I put it in it's almost like a oil reading is how you do it I pull it out and it shows me exactly where I am here and that's how I measured where I am so I don't know if I that's how I measure where I am so it's almost like an oil reading if you are having that problem and can't figure out in bottles like this especially if it has a pump completely wipe it off and then dip it back in and bring it carefully out and it will mark it for you where it is and then you can mark it on the outside that's just a tip is yes, I completely finished the Smashbox primer water this is my second bottle I love this I did take some of this and refill it with um, a small uh, Mac fix plus and I'm almost done with that so I do deem this I completely finished the other one this is a brand new bottle well, not brand new right now. I'm about halfway through this and I don't know if I'll completely finish this. I probably won't do that in 20 days, but I have been using it to set my face and prime my face as well as um, afterwards to let those powders fuse if I'm using a powder. So I really do enjoy this. The Tarte Shape Tape, been loving this. Now, y'all know the Born This Way Multi Sculpting Concealer, Multi Use Concealer. Love that. It trumps over this to me as a year round, but I really like this in the summer because I have it on today. I, it's full coverage. I don't have to set it with a powder. I did not set my face at all with a powder today, and I love the glow that I get, and I really do enjoy this. Um, so I can't say that I would not purchase it again. I do have it in medium and in tan, and I'm trying to get through both of them I don't know where it is on this but um, this one is gonna be a little bit harder just because it's a thicker consistency but like I said I'm going to use this until it feels dry it feels too dry to use and then I'll switch over to my born this way but I wanted to give that some love and the best way to do that is put it in a project pan just to make sure that I use it okay so let me tell you the dark chocolate Soleil bronzer by Too Faced. I actually passed it on to my sister. I have some other ones that, that I want to get through and I don't have it in a project pan right now. I don't have a bronzer but I did declutter and pass that on just because I wanted my sister to get some love and she is like a shade darker than me and I know that that would work for her. So I decluttered that and I got rid of the YSL Coral Touch. Y'all that lipstick Okay, I'm, I plan on doing the Sephora, my first Sephora orders. That was one of my orders, y'all. 
I know. I love doing videos like this because you don't realize it. And I was like, I have to do this. I have to come and let y'all know about that lipstick because it was old. I called CJ, my girl, and she was like, girl, your lips gonna fall off. I could not believe how old that lipstick was. And I was like, oh, before it expires, baby. It already expired. And the scent didn't give it away. But y'all, make some rules for yourself. If you haven't finished a lipstick by a certain time that you're just going to throw it away. Because I did not even realize how old that lipstick is. Don't ask me because y'all already know it's old. Okay. But we're going to pass on to that and let's bring in some new items into our finished 5 by fall. So I have three right here. I'm actually going to add, yeah, I'm going to add two more. So I'm going to put in the Becca Backlight Priming Filter. I love this. I have been using this and mixing them together with my moisturizer. And I talk about that in my favorites video, the concoction that I made. But I'm halfway done through this and I have been using it nonstop. I definitely want to use it as much as possible. And that is something that I definitely would pick back up just because I like the soft focus and I love the look. I love illuminating primers and Becca does primers really well. So I'm doing that one and I am bringing in this hourglass. Now this was in some previous, I think my Sephora rehaul like project pan that I had and I'm bringing this back in for the finished by five by fall and I'm going to do like the 12 days of Christmas. I'm probably going to have this in there just because once the year is out, I am going to declutter this. This is an old item. This is about three years old and I have decided if a powder is three years old, older um, it depends on what it is I am going going to declutter it and I feel like I can if I hit this hard I can get done with this so I'm gonna have this in 12 days of Christmas so by New Year's the new year I want to be picking up another one or the next Sephora uh, for spring I'll be picking up one of these but I love this palette and I want to get some use and some love into this one and although it looks like it's a white powder it looks great when you buff it and finish it off. I did use this just to use to set but this is one of those finely milled powders that's a finishing powder rather than a setting powder to me. So yeah those are my finished 5 by fall. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what you are getting through, what you want to declutter, what, what has expired. I am guilty so I had to get rid of that and yeah thanks so much for watching you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.